Welcome everyone, this is Master Joke, also Master Joke 75 on Instagram. So, um, you might have seen in a previous video if you bothered, if you bothered watching, if you, were, if you were one of the few that watched, uh, that I got a um, delivery from Star Action Figures of the um, Star Wars um, Retro Collection Wave 4, The Mandalorian. Um, the, the the figure that I was most excited about was the um, the Death Trooper, but also the uh, you know the Boba Fett for obvious reasons. So um, yeah, so join me in the opening of my new Boba Fett. So uh, I mean the the actual card back. I think I said it in the last video when I was going through all the figures. It seems to be a, a like a thicker card. You've still got the sticker, and I don't mind. I don't mind the sticker. I think it's all right. Um, it's got the, it's still got the distress round, but it's just thicker, and I just think they've done a good job. I also um, I know that um, the uh, book of Boba Fett, obviously his uh, his armor's got a bit more battered, but this is the the, the photos um, from the uh, freshly painted Boba Fett armor, and I just think it looks I think it looks awesome. And the figure, I mean, just just seeing the figure in the uh, in the bubble, it just I mean, it's just brilliant. I mean, this one this one blew me away when I saw they were releasing this it it just blew me away and I, and I and I did say the same about the vintage collection um the Tatooine Boba Fett figure you know I, I love Boba Fett it's my second favorite figure after um Darth Vader character uh but let's um now that's the back of the box nothing much to see but let's get this guy open Also, I mean, I I open my. I know a lot of people. They like to keep the card backs, and they're very careful about opening their uh, their figures. But I'm old school. This is how I used to open my uh, figures from uh, from Tesco's and Argus back in the 80s. So, um, so yeah. I mean, I'll, I'll just be chucking this. But um, yeah, let's get this bad boy out. Right, so this, I know it's like, um, it's the old vintage style, the old retro style, but this is absolutely, absolutely fantastic. It comes with his two weapons. He's got his rocket on the back. See, I mean, it's exactly the same as it was. It was exactly the same as the original, where, you know, the little, um, for the rocket firing Boba Fett, where the little, uh, the, the little design, where the little, um, <laughs> what's, it, what's it called? The little catch or the little knob went on the back but let's um let's get him stood up right what can i say about this blob effect it is absolutely amazing i just it's it's just a fantastic figure i mean the colors are so vibrant and it's just so much like the original um boba fett and the kenner lion i like the fact that you can um you can put his his uh smaller gun um just you know, there's a little place for it to to sit, and also he he can actually hold his um, figures. Sorry, hold his um, weapons, unlike the um, Wave One of the Retro Collection. So let's compare it to the um, Tatooine Vintage Collection Boba Fett, just as a comparison. I mean, it's, you know, there's no, there is no comparison. I mean, this is the best, this is the best Star Wars figure I've ever ever owned. I mean, it's amazing, but. Um, I think I've got to say that this Boba Fett, this is the best retro collection figure they've released, um, and I mean that including the um, the originals. It's, it's just amazing, and uh, like the head. I mean, the colour, the, the the vibrant of the colours, and I don't know if you can see that the actual. The actual head head sculpts. It's just it's just brilliant. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. So um so there you go. Fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. Keep it up, Hasbro. That's all I can say. Just keep it up. Um so I hope you liked this video. Uh don't don't forget to like and subscribe. It lets me know you care. Hopefully I'll have another video out um very soon. 
Um, join me in that video. This vlog is over. <laughs>